you guys swag tech here um, today I'm gonna teach you guys how we can make Nintendo 64 games work on our HP touchpad and as you can see it is pretty clean I mean it is lag free and there's a lot of games to choose from um, it's actually pretty complex how they put it online but to be honest it only took me what four or five minutes to actually do it so yeah it is really easy so yeah let's get started first you put plug in your um, your touchpad into the computer and make sure you do not choose USB mode we need two things from the internet the emulator itself and webOS quick install both of the things um, I've put them in the description below um, so yeah let's get started oh yeah make sure you have preware installed in, on your device and you're in developer mode uh, I'm not sure if those things play a big role but yeah you have to have them in there alright so you basically go to tools you click send file and now we want to choose the emulator from here alright and the destination should be media internal and n64 and then you click send to device I've already done this so I don't need to repeat it but once that's done it should say successful and we don't really need the computer anymore but um alright so you come here on your touchpad and you go to preware alright let that load up alright so we go in the corner and we click install package and you click browse and you, after you've done this it should show up as n64 the file you just put if it has not there is another method you could put the emulator on your device and that's by plugging your device in, into USB mode going inside your USB uh, touchpad and creating a folder called N64 and putting the emulator inside there but as long as you follow the tutorial um, should work out after you after you go inside the N64 you click on the emulator and you click OK now see I've already done this but you're gonna click install and once it's done you should get the emulator on your device now after that's done now we want to get the ROMs into your device which which are the games itself so you go into the computer and now actually yeah you're supposed to plug your plug it in again yeah this time you want to plug in your device and enter USB mode so USB drive alright let the computer sense it a bit alright so it's open go into your touchpad and you go into your N64 file alright <clears throat> now there's a website called coolrom.com and it actually has a lot of freaking games that you can choose from but make sure you get the N64 games um, I've downloaded, already downloaded a couple right here let's go to it Alright, here we are. See, <clears throat> you're supposed to download them as zip files. So yeah, let's say you want Super Mario 64. It's going to come in either a Z64 uh, file type, um, V64, and there's one more, but I forgot. Anyway, so you drag it onto your HP touchpad. And as you can see, I got like about seven, eight games already. And that's it. That's about it. You're, the game's inside your touchpad. So you come back here. Disconnect the thing. Ow, that hurts. Uh, weird message. Pain. Come on, dude. All right, you go into the N64 thing, and yeah, it'll show up. Now, a lot of games do not have sound. Actually, no, I, I wouldn't say that. Some games do not have sound. Some games do not allow you to save, and others are really glitched up. So yeah, there's a lot of bugs in this, but some games are pretty cool. You know, like the whole thing works I mean straight up it is genius how awesome this shit is man but after you do that um, actually that's about it man so yeah uh, if you have any questions and stuff ask below comment rate subscribe peace out people